Hello, Gothic friends, Razzis, my name. Welcome back to the worst let's play of the world, Gothic 1 Unreal Engine. We are on Fire Mage in this episode. We are about to go to the uh, sex camp and give them the eggs. But before we do that, we have to increase our ma mana a bit. And we have six learning points. We are going to use only five of them. And we are going to level three times up in the third chapter and then come back and buy the the next uh, circle of fire and the uh, high robe of magicians. I need more magic power. I can help you to in so five times. That's enough for now. We have ten. The spells do not cost a lot in this uh, game. Oh, and uh, once saving, the light is still being saved. That's very good. Normally, that disappears. Do we have anything to loot here? Because we are a fire mage, actually. Damn it. Wow. Cannot believe it. Two power probably that increases us something. But luckily we can loot them. I forgot about that. Okay, that was just the other way around. Some books that we can read when we are tired. Oh, damn it. So complicated. We will have to sleep also, no fun running into the night. To the sect loonies to advance to the third chapter we have to yeah there is something here but we cannot do it with the alchemy we have to increase our mana to 100 also to be able to use the potions and it's weird that we are a magician of fire now but nobody has a quest for us have to be careful with the uh, in extremo because that has copyrights, I didn't know about that. I hope that's not the case. You're just passing by. If not, have to remove it. Now oh, let's go as fast as possible. I believe in the third chapter they disappear. Hopefully, otherwise it's always going to be removed from the game. And the light still exists after we we saved, we slept, we reloaded. Not bad at all. So now we have to go to the sect camp, get to the third chapter, and then we have to get three level ups. One is almost. We are almost one level up. Two more. Yeah. So we have to use magic for those. Let's. The next one's up there. Yeah, easy peasy with the sword, but we have to use the magic. The fireball? Fire arrow, fireball, I see no difference. Okay, we have a lizard there. Oh, wow. Okay, this is going to... Ah, but at, le at least we can uh, move now and attack. That's not bad. We have to increase our mana with stuff. Because we only have 10 mana. Okay. Uh, let's check the, the fireball. Yeah, the, the magic doesn't really look good, sadly. Yeah, the magic looks a bit weird. I expected better quality. 
maybe the later spells are going to look better because this was quite disappointing. We might as well just go with the sword and just act as a mage until we get powerful spells. More experience for us. Yeah, later on we will go there and clear the snappers and so on. Right? Because we should actually just go, yeah, let's just go and advance the, the next chapter. Because then we get a better robe. I believe that we can buy the high magician of fire robe. We might be able to, or I hope that we are able to. Oops. Luckily they deal no damage to us, because our defense is much higher than their attack. That's a thing here. Lots of weak enemies that we can still kill and earn some experience. And level up. I hope they are not going to fight with each other. Oh, they killed us. They stripped us of two scavenger guys. Two or three. But it's okay. Oh, they killed a lot more stuff. Yeah, we lost more experience. A bloodfly, two bloodflies, two scavengers. That's what happens when we don't really clear, but it's okay. I do enjoy to get lots of experience, I have to admit it. But this way, I don't know if we have to collect the meat and stuff. But it's part of the game, so we can enjoy it. Why not? We will kill the other guys also. Because we did level up once. There are the the works that we have to be careful with on the other side. Yeah, look at them there. Okay. So might be that we give up on magic for now. As much as it hurts me to say that. It doesn't look great, it doesn't seem to be fun as I expected. I do want to clear this thing. This side of the forest. Oh, there are more wolves. How oh, far away? Yeah, we are still far away from the next level. But we will still learn the circle levels anyway. No matter what. Because with the third circle, or when we have better spells, might be better. Do we have better spells? No, nope, we don't. All those? Oh, we, we were here. Yes. The other ones are up here. This forest is good. It's small. Lots of critters that we can kill. Yeah, what's up? Not in the mood to attack? I believe that's it, right? Nothing more to be had here. Those are all the monsters that we can find here. In this small forest. In this one there are some works. And they must be powerful. This forest, we almost cleared it also, when we were looking for the focus stone. Now we can simply go to the sect camp and hopefully get the third level, third level, third chapter. Then we will have more monsters to be spawned in here. The goblins, we had some problems, so I would advise for going to the... Old camp after we trigger the third chapter. 
we have to anyway, it's on the way. We're all halfway there. But would be nice to go there once we are we have 25 learning points. Because the monsters are stronger, so and with a stronger armor, then we could be a bit stronger. We don't have to do the almanac guys, I believe. Otherwise, or is it directly in the third chapter that the the old camp is going to be close? I don't know how it's going to get to be. Nah, must be not because Carissa doesn't sell us the high rope yet. Lester, my friend, do you care that I got a mine crawlers? No, I got their eggs. Money? Ah, oh, we have some money. We have to talk with Balkadar also to see what spells he sells. It's so bright in here. Not really a swampy feeling. Yeah, that's way too crystal clear. Or a swampy swamp. Oh, we have to go to Corcalon, right? Ah, he could have increased our power also. Protection O oh, against weapons. No strength. Fist of wind that we get because we don't have one. Healing we have, light we have. Okay, that's it. And that was it, so Corcolum. Get your eggs together and brew something powerful for us. We can get our portion of the swamp with Is Fortuna going to show us his small Fortuna? Thank you. The armor looks nice, but the posture of us wearing it is not as great as I expected. Yeah, the, the hands movement is... What's up with that? Makes it look weird. Let's see. Hey you. What do you I have crawler's mandibles for you. Very good. Take some of my best potions as reward. A lot of potions. Now we can save and see what options we have with him. I found eggs belonging to a crawler queen. I knew it. My vision was a sign. The queen's eggs must contain the strong secretion. Excellent. With it, I can create a potion to contact the sleeper. What about my reward? Oh, right. Thank you. Yeah, that's it. Thank you. Okay. Okay. What do you want? Money. So healing, weapons, rune or mana. Rune could be mana. May this potion strengthen the magic within you. Can we start invoking the sleeper now? No. I haven't found a method to charge the focus yet. We are missing the ancient knowledge about these artifacts. Do you mean to say I collected the eggs for nothing? No. Listen to me. There is an almanac which contains what we need to know. Stolen by goblins. Black goblins even. From the old camp. However, it was stolen when they tried to bring it here from the old camp. I had charged Talas, a novice, with collecting the book for me. But he was robbed. He let me down. But I've given him another chance. He must get the stolen almanac back. Talk to him. Kane is just gliding, gliding about. Where can I find Talus? He's in the forecourt, at the Temple Hill, trying to get people to help him. Who stole the almanac? Talas told me he was mugged by black goblins. It sounds strange, but not, not impossible. impossible. True. What will I get for it? Have I not already proven my generosity to you? You will receive a just reward. Oh, okay. We didn't advance the, the chapter, sadly. That means we have to fight the goblins with this robe. 
it's going to be painful. I thought we we would get second level, uh, third chapter. There is no way down. So. Oh, no damage taken. Okay. Look at this. It is so mad. So tell us, we know about you. You're just smoking. You got robbed because you wear nothing on you. That's why. You're Talus, the one who was mugged. Leave me alone. I don't want to talk about it. I can help you to bring the almanac back. Really? I was mugged by goblins, and now I'm supposed to go there and get the book back. I have a suggestion to make. I'll show you the way to the almanac, so you can get it back. Why me and not you? Give me fifty ore, and I'm in. What? That's robbery. All right then. Tell me when you're ready. Yeah, you have to pay because I'm not from the tech camp. Okay. Follow me. Your money are going to be donated to Enos, your lord. And in this gothic one, they don't really talk about Enos, Adenos, or Beliar. They are just being mentioned a couple times, and that's it. In the second one, they go a lot more with that. And in the third, I believe a lot. I've never finished the third, I only played for a little bit and then had to end it because it was way too buggy. And I didn't really like the click attack. But you can fight with the orcs from now from the start, from the get go, but you cannot fight the animals. But that's another tema. No need to go into it. I believe there are a lot of people that do like the gothic tree, so. It's just our opinions. So the third chapter doesn't start yet. I thought it would start right now. But now we have to get the almanac and after that it starts. Hopefully it will not be too late to go to the old camp. And by the page, the high robe of magicians of fire. Because it is in offer there, so that means you can really get it. It's quite fast. The little dude. But that's a good thing, that means we will get our three levels to to learn the the third circle of fire. Or is it the fourth? Yeah, the fourth we are already. Another one. Yeah, tell me about it. Nice. Look how many goblins are there. It's going to be hard. Maybe with magic we can do something. Those damn little beasts live in a cave behind this bridge. Be careful. Come with me. Coming with me. I'll wait here and uh, <clears throat> cover our retreat. You little coward. So, what's going to be? Can we use magic? It's something that increases magic. Life, life. Oh, everything is life bonus. That's nothing. Okay, that's a mana bonus. Okay, good. Wow, how big it gets. Okay, that's as big as it gets. Okay, at least we can do them from afar. We can do them dirty. Hope that's enough. Yeah, the, the magic doesn't really look good at all, sadly. Okay, actually we can tank a lot more now. I know many people don't collect those stuff, but I do like to collect them. Then he had a weapon. And also, oh, there it is. They glided. So, we have a cave full of goblins. We need mana to be able to fight from with them from afar, for a little bit far. If we were a guard, we would be much stronger now. But we are not a guard. We want to 
do it nice. Nothing here. We are a battle mage now. That can be actually a thing. Oh boy. Oh yeah, the, the problem here was before the aggro range, but now that's not a problem anymore, for sure. He would pull every single one of them. Nice. We can beat them. We are good battle mage, so there is something. Potions. Starts to rain outside, I believe. We have a lot of stuff to cook. We got a new spell, right? What does it require? 3 mana for 30 damage. And this is 5 for 150, and this is 1 for 30. Yeah, it's about the same, only that the thing is this one. Deals more damage at once, but it charges, so it's a good good opener. And the fire arrow is good because it can deal a lot of damage. Something more, right? Can barely see something here. Okay, nothing. But look at our health, that's not healthy at all. I hope we can level up here, it would be nice. Yeah, we can actually miss somehow. Oh, we have a bad view, we don't see if something is going to come and kick our ass. Forget to save, Razian. Don't forget to save. We can save our health, our life. Okay, we go this way now. Hundred twenty health. Yeah, in this version they have no loot, nothing. I believe in in the gothic one they are just stealing and putting everything what they steal in a chest or more chest. But in gothic today. They are more savage and hold everything that they have with them. Oh, what about the uh, two-handed? Can we actually deal anything with it? Okay, not worth it. Yeah, for some reason the... Oh, we are now full left. Health. I don't. I don't get it. How it's working? Yeah, the difference is not so big. That's why two-handed is very good at the very beginning of the game. But I really expected to have more problems. There was something else to pick up. I saw something on the screen. But the two-handed is very good at the very beginning because it did a lot of damage. Oh, there it is. Ah, night shadow. was a lightning, I believe, that got inside the cave. That's why it was bright for a second. So, a couple arrows. Fireball. Oh, we have to sell the fireballs and stuff because we don't need them. And here is the almanac that they need. Oh, the repair. Must be... Expired, right? Outside in the game is raining, in the real life it's raining, just perfect to enjoy gothic. But the cape wasn't as crazy as I expected, and we did level up. That's very good. That is good. Oh, the sounds are very good. So we can actually heal ourselves, right? 
Okay. We can do that, but that's very good if we play the battle mage. Otherwise, trading health for mana is not great. So we will stick with the battle mage for for now. Well done. Let's go back to the camp. Yeah, you you deserve to be beaten. You didn't want to help at all, but we will not go that route. Yeah, I'll keep you warm. Tell us, don't you worry. We will keep ourselves warm. When we hold the torch, actually the robe looks very nice, but oh, without the torch then we look like we are so stiff, especially in this clothes. So for the end game weapon I believe we are going to stick to Rizial. Because the magic the magic doesn't look great. I don't know why they didn't put effort into the magic effects or why the Unreal Engine is not showing great fire fire magic or maybe I'm just a noob and I, I mess it up in the setting somewhere it looks like a storm but uh, the rain is very nice Cork, hello my friend you can start now with a invocation of the sleeper so we can see the sleeper Why don't you do it? You don't stress yourself out. Don't worry, I sure won't. There's no need to worry about me. Yeah, tell me about it. Well, let's go the shortest way. I hope the robes are not going to get wet. Actually, they don't because they are magical robes. Yeah, you guys don't mind that it's raining, right? To go, yeah, you keep. Praising him, pray to him and don't go out of the rain. That's good life. I wish there was an element implemented when it's raining that they go somewhere or they have some roof above their head. Or maybe they don't really go out of the way because they are crazy, they are loonies. Might be the second. Or they are just brave enough, they have the power of the sleeper in their hearts. So climb, climb, climb. We, we might have to buy all the the fast running potions, otherwise it's going to take forever to run from A to B. Oh, we didn't read the book. You have all we need. I'll complete the preparations now. Where will the invocation take place? Wait till night time. Then come to the temple courtyard. We will gather there to invoke the almighty sleeper. What about my payment? What do you want? Oh, again. Mana potions we don't need. Spell scrolls or ore. May these potions give you strength. The long time of waiting is now over. Through his immeasurable powers, the sleeper has led us to this place so we can witness his awakening. The artifact he showed us in a vision will focus our spiritual powers. Unite your thoughts so the sleeper will hear our prayers, for his is the path that leads to freedom, and we are his chosen people. May the sleeper awaken! to show us the way to freedom. Yes, what about it? Was it the path to freedom? Silence! 
It is obvious. The path to freedom leads through the orcs. The sleeper has shown us a place. We must find it. Not far from here, there is an entry to an orc cave. We'll start searching there. The sleeper will be with us. What does that mean? Shall we fight these monsters? I'll go with the Templars. You novices shall pray for us. Okay, that was weird. We didn't have to wait for the night time. We simply... Oh, that was beautiful. We simply got here. And we saw in the video that he was being dragged away from here. The Iberian, but now he's back here again. So, I guess we are in the third chapter. We are going to make a cut here. And in the next episode, we will go to the old camp, get a high robe, we'll learn the fourth circle of magic, I believe we can. I don't know if we can, the, uh, the, the fifth, if we have it available, I have no clue. But that is beautiful, so I'll see you guys in the next episode. Be cool and bye-bye.